Hello guys, welcome to Mr. Legend Crypto. Guys, in this video, we're taking a look at an altcoin, Velodrome Finance. We're currently having a huge rally. Velodrome Finance is up on a weekly time frame, on a monthly time frame, also on a yearly time frame. So how long will it take Velodrome Finance to get to $10? Can we continue pumping higher in 2023? Velodrome Finance has started the year on a very bright note, pumping by more than a thousand percent. In this video, we'll take a look at the Velodrome Finance US dollar price chart, Velodrome Finance performance against Bitcoin, and we'll also take a look at Velodrome Finance performance against Ethereum. We'll be talking about that and more in this video. But first, guys, when it comes to investing, nothing will pay off more than educating yourself. And investment in knowledge pays the best interest. So all my returning subscribers, thanks for always watching all my videos. I appreciate you guys. If you're new to this channel and you want to get the latest crypto news, price predictions, chart analysis, this is the channel for you. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more awesome videos like this. Let's get down to business. Village Finance has a market cap of $27 million. It has a fully directed market cap of $77 million, a maximum supply of 400 million coins. And right now, we have more than 141 million of those Village Room Finance tokens in circulation. Village Room Finance is currently pumping on a weekly time frame, on a monthly time frame, and also on a yearly time frame. Village Room Finance is up 287% in the last one month. If you take a look at the Veridum Finance US dollar price chart, this all coin was launched deep in the crypto bear market in 2022. And guys, we saw this all coin rally by more than a thousand percent from July 2022 to August 2022. But what happened after that rally is that Veridum Finance went down to Goblin Town after pumping by more than 1,500 percent. We saw Veridum Finance go down by 84 percent. All coins can be very, very volatile especially all coins that have a small market cap like Veridum Finance. Veridum Finance market cap right now is just around $27 million. Veridum Finance continue accumulation. And when we started 2023, guys, Veridum Finance started 2023 on a very bright note. We saw Veridum Finance trading around $0.018 on the 1st of January 2023. What happened after that is Veridum Finance has been pumping to the moon. Veridum Finance has been going to higher prices, getting to its all-time high. Of zero point two four dollars. Veridum Finance has gone up by more than one thousand two hundred percent in the last fifty four days. How long will it take us to get to that wonderful ten dollar region? Veridum Finance is up twelve x. A thousand dollar invested in Veridum Finance at the start of the year would have been worth more than twelve thousand dollars right now. But can we continue pumping to higher prices? Or are we gearing up for one dump to the downside, guys? Veridum Finance market cap is around twenty seven million dollars. If Veridum Finance is going to be trading around $10, we'll have to see the market cap go to around a billion dollars. Is that possible? Guys, I think that's very, very possible. When we go to the crypto bull run, Veridum Finance is in its first crypto bear market. Veridum Finance is still in the early stages of infancy. Now, in this bear market rally we're having right now, how high do we think Veridum Finance can go? I think we're literally getting to the end of that rally. If you're a long-time investor, you will wait for that dump to come because guess what, guys? Anytime you see an altcoin pumping aggressively to the upside like Veridum Finance is doing, there's always going to be the dump. There's always going to be another period of accumulation. The last thing you want to be doing is following at higher prices, expecting it to continue pumping in a straight line. The best time to accumulate is when we're down in Goblin Town. I first discovered Veridum Finance when we first had this 10x pump. And guess what, guys? We still saw it dump back to Goblin Town. And the best time to buy Veridum Finance was in September 2022. And guess what was happening in the market then? There was extreme fear in the crypto market. A lot of people thought all coins were going to zero. But since September, Veridum Finance has returned more than a 1,500% pump to the upside. And according to the Fibonacci retracement tool, Veridum Finance can still even pump to as high as the $0.38 region. From where we're currently trading right now, Veridum Finance will need to pump an additional 100% for us to get there. And with all coins, that can happen in one day. With all coins, that can happen very, very quickly. Now, how long will it take Veridum Finance to get to $10? Guys, that will take a while. I believe Veridum Finance, by the end of the next bull run, might see it pumping above $10. Now, that's a very, very long shot. You have to be willing to hold Veridum Finance for the long haul if you're going to participate in that pump. Remember, guys, with all coins, it can be very, very volatile, both to the upside and to the downside. When we get to the bull market, when we see Bitcoin pumping towards $100,000, we see Ethereum pumping towards $10,000.
I will not be shocked to see Village Room Finance rallying above $1, heading to $5, and probably getting to as high as $10 by the end of the next bull run. From where we are currently trading right now, if Village Room Finance is going to magically get to $10, guys, we need Village Room Finance to 50x from where we are currently trading. That's when Village Room Finance to go up over 5,000%. Freedom Finance has a market cap of, let's say, approximately $30 million. And $30 million multiplied by 50, we're getting around $1.5 billion. So do you think Freedom Finance market cap can get to as high as $1.5 billion by the end of the next bull run? Guys, I think that's very, very possible. Velodrome Finance is an AMM designed as a central trading and liquidity marketplace on Optimism Network. And Optimism is a layer 2 network on top of Ethereum. And I believe in the next bull run, we're going to be seeing layer 2s pumping to the moon. We're going to be seeing layer 2s going to higher prices. And I believe Velodrome Finance is one of those altcoins that is going to do that. If you want to buy or sell some Velodrome Finance right now, guys, you can do that on Uniswap, on BitGet, on BKEX, on MEXE and on Velodrome, on Bitroot, and more exchanges are being added daily. Velodrome Finance is still a new coin. Remember, we're not going to just continue pumping a straight line. We're going to have a lot of dips along the way. We're going to have a lot of dumps along the way. But guys, only those who survive through the bear market will finally get that wonderful pump that we're waiting for to the upside. Velodrome Finance is still a new coin. It's still less than a year in the market. It's still called a virgin coin. It has not been through crypto's bull run. And the bull run, things go up crazily, very, very fast. But right in the bear market is where you want to begin your accumulation. Deep in the bear market is when you want to be getting ready for that wonderful pump to the upside if it ever happens. And remember, guys, you don't want to go all in when you're buying these all coins. You don't want to just carry all your capital one time and say, you know what? I'm going to be buying. I know to never dump to Goblin Town. The best method to buy these all coins that are very, very volatile is by dollar cost averaging so that in case they continue dumping to Goblin Town, you have some capital on the side. And right now, I'll not be shocked to see Valerian Finance have a huge dump, maybe to come back and test the previous all-time high around the $0.098 level. We saw it stock below that level since July of 2022. As we are pumping above that level in February, we had to walk our way slowly but surely. So it will not be shocking to see Valerian Finance come back to test that level Guys, in the bear market, you want to accumulate. In the bear market is where you get your first 10x, 20x, even your first 100x coin. If you take a look at what Veridum Finance has done in the last one month, Veridum Finance has gone from as low as $0.04 to as high as $0.25. With a market cap of $27 million and a fully dieted market cap of $77 million, Veridum Finance is ranked 2,625 on coin market cap. Over 4,600 people have Velodrome Finance on their watch list. Now, if you take a look at Velodrome Finance performance against Bitcoin, we have been seeing it outperform Bitcoin in this bear market rally. Right now, Velodrome Finance is up more than 698% against Bitcoin. At some point in time, this bear market rally, it was up around 896% against Bitcoin. Why this good news for Velodrome Finance holders? At the same time, guys, remember, Velodrome Finance can keep outperforming Bitcoin for the long haul. All coins are known to be very volatile. If we see the market pumping, they pump way harder than Bitcoin. And right now, in this bear market rally, Bitcoin has gone from $15,000 to as high as $25,000. And that's about a 50% pump. Velodrome Finance has gone up by more than 875%. The road to $10 is going to be very, very long. The road to ten dollars is going to be very very chaotic but let's expect that at some point in time we finance with dump to goblin town against bitcoin if you're a long-term investor that's going to be music to your ears that's going to give you opportunity to accumulate more value finance tokens getting ready for the crypto bull run guys in the bull run all coins can go crazily and the bull run pumps make all these bear market pumps look like nothing to write home about Veridum Finance is also outperforming Ethereum. If you see what Veridum Finance has done since the turn of the year, we have seen it outperform Ethereum by more than 900%. All coins can be volatile, but when we see them pumping to the upside, we see them outperforming both Bitcoin and Ethereum. At the same time, you don't want to get sucked into those pumps because if you are caught buying the top, you just see your Veridum Finance tokens value dumping to Goblin Town and you might be forced to sell at lower prices. So sometimes patience is the key. You want to pay attention to when the market will go back to fear. You want to pay attention to when a lot of market participants will think we're dumping to Goblin Town. That's when you want to be accumulating more, getting ready for the next bull run. I believe we're going to get to $10 eventually. It's going to take a while. Religion finance market caps at $20 million. 
for it to get to 1.5 billion dollars guys it's going to take a lot of work we'll have to see bitcoin pumping towards hundred thousand dollars ethereum pumping towards ten thousand dollars and the whole crypto market going to the moon so guys drop your thoughts in the comment section how high do you see Velodrome Finance going to by the end of the next bull run? Do you think it's possible for Velodrome Finance market cap to get to as high as $1.5 billion by the end of the next bull run? Drop your thoughts about that in the comment section. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more awesome videos like this. Turn on the post notification to get notified anytime I drop a new video. Remember guys, when it comes to investing, nothing will pay off more than educating yourself. And investment in knowledge pays the best interest. Invest for the long haul. Don't get too scared. Don't get too greedy. See you guys in my next video. Seven, one.